Hi, Seth Davies with Competitive Solutions. Welcome to this week's Tuesday Tip. How does your organization share key business information? Does it advertise it or does it communicate it? Most organizations advertise information and that's validated by the employee surveys which say communication is one of the top issues in the organization. Advertising is one way. It requires someone to read and respond. Have you ever been walking down the hall in your organization and someone comes up to you and says, hey, did you get that email I sent to you? What they're asking is, why haven't you responded to it? What about bulletin boards? Have you ever stopped and spent five minutes reading the bulletin board in your organization? We've got to get back to the basics of face-to-face -face communication and share with our employees what's going on in the organization, what they need to know to do their job. It also helps remove the rumor mill and the grapevine. Let's talk about how does this work. It starts at the top with the leadership team, having a standard meeting process where they meet at a certain time every week. And during that meeting, they share key business information in what's called a pass down item. The next level then meets following that, followed by the third and the fourth levels of the organization. We go from the strategic to the tactical. So by the end of the day, or within the next 24 hours, every person in the organization has had a weekly face-to-face -face communication where they've talked about the business and they received the pass down items. Take a look at the standard meeting agenda. Every team needs to use this agenda. They can't take away from it, but they can certainly add to it. But notice one of the key points on there, one of the agenda topics, pass down. This is where key information is disseminated out. Perhaps HR has information about the new benefits plan or the IT department needs everyone to know about a server upgrade that's gonna happen over the weekend. As that meeting is taking place, when we get to the pass down items, whatever was shared at the meeting previously is communicated here. For communication to work in organizations, we've got to understand the difference between advertising and communicating. We've got to have communication of two-way face-to-face. We've got to have that pass down item, that cascading conduit, so that everyone in the organization knows what happens. We've got a robust pass down item, and that meetings Instead of having a meeting just to come together, we have meetings to talk about the business and help move the business forward. Next week, I'm gonna talk about metrics and how do we create meaningful metrics to connect our employees to the business.